Got my first find. I heard something. Kind of bouncy. Ground's a little bit muddy. A little close by now. Real muddy. This piece. Knocked it loose. Like a piece of can slaw. See you in the next one. I hope I'm got that. A really squelchy high tone. I think I'm on that something big in irony. Definitely big. Definitely irony. Not really sure what that could be. I'm not going to bother cleaning that off. I'll let it dry on my find table another day. See you at my next one. Had another one of those uh, high tones, squelchy with some iron in it. Got another something. Looks like a chunk of iron flat bar. Been down there a while. See you at my next one. Got a, another squelchy one. Probably got to be a piece of iron again. Pretty sure it's in the plug. Ground's really moist, highly conductive today. Not sure where it is. Seem to have lost it. See you after I find it. Had to go really deep after that one. Not really sure what it is. I must be, you know, pinpointer plus two deep. If you recognize that shape? Add it into the comments. Got something in the plug. Um, with my luck so far, I'm not going to make any promises or guesses on what that thing might be. Because everything up to this point has been junk. I must have knocked it loose. Now I've lost my signal. in hand looks like it's gonna end up being that little tiny thing right there I'm gonna call that uh, a nothing see you at my next one still looking for that first coin got something in here I think I might, no, thought I saw a coin, now I think I see a, thought I saw a heart, but I guess that's a rock. It's in hand. 
like a piece of aluminum flashing or something. Not my first coin. See you at my next one. Still looking for that first coin. I think it's in the plug. Oh, I might see the edge of a coin there. I see the edge of something. It is not a coin. At least it's something. Let me grab my brush. Part of it just fell off, a chunk of it. Not really sure what that is. It was something. I do not know what, but if you happen to recognize anything of that shape, uh, Add it into the comments. Got a 15, 16, 17. In here, uh, I'm not expecting anything real super great. But who's to say? Till you figure out what it is. I see something. And I see a pool tab. See you at my next one. Oh, got another signal. It's over on this side. Nice if it was a coin, any coin. Clumps getting smaller, chances of a coin are getting slimmer. Looks like a Chunk of can slaw. See you in the next one. Got another one. Uh, chance of a nickel. Chance of a pool tab. Chance of a gold ring. What do you think my chances are? Right here. Start getting around that grass thatch. I start thinking garbage. Nope. I think I got a meat to that pool tab. Let's see you at my next one. I got what could be a penny signal. Right in there. It's in hand. That is not a penny. Not sure what that is. It's one of them things that kind of looks like it could be something. Nope. 
gonna just junk. See you at my next one. Got a solid 19. Uh, what I wouldn't do for a zinc penny right now. Close by. Oh, looky there. Got my wish finally. I think it's got a memorial and it's got some discoloration on the front like it's starting to rot. Got me a zincin finally. First penny of the day. See you at my next one. Well, I think I got best signal of the day. Um, could be a copper penny, could be a dime. I'm pretty sure maybe I'm not that sure anymore well, I thought it was in the plug it appears to be in the hole let's shift around here a little bit over in there it's going to require a little extra digging Ground super moist. Still down here somewhere. What about in there? I'll see you after I find it. I think I got it scooped out. Guess what's in the clump? It's in this little tiny clump. Oh, I see a coin. Lucky day. Looks like I got another penny. It's probably gonna be a copper penny. There's Lincoln. There's a memorial. See you at my next one. Well, I had a decent tone uh, right here by this tree. Uh, I can't normally metal detect here because it's filled up with plants. There's Lincoln. Might say 1972. Copper penny. Another memorial. See you at my next one. I've got another high tone. Uh, this might be 2930. It's down in here next to that tree where I can't normally metal detect. About there. Let's pop out a big old silver quarter that's been sitting here for years. Kicked it loose. Yeah. Got something. It's like an old button. Pretty sure that's it. Yep, I pulled an old button. Still has the shank on the back of it. That's pretty cool. Uh, I can't tell if there's anything on the front, but it does have like stuff that'll help me identify the maker. I think on the back, I thought I saw some, oops, text. Nope, I rubbed a lot of stuff off of there. Oh, the patina. 
brush a little softer. I think I'll just leave that to dry out. But that's pretty cool. I got an old flat button. That's uh, way past the period of this house. See you at my next one. Got another target around this tree. So I've been doing pretty good here. Much better than I did in the rest of the yard. It's out in front of me. I don't see anything yet. Dropped it. Dropped it and lost it. So I need somebody with a metal detector that could find it. Must be super small. Keep moving it. Or I got another target here I'm chasing. That's a piece of wood. I'll see if I find it. Otherwise, I might even just cut this clip out. Found it, I think. Just a little tiny piece of uh, old hooked metal. Not really sure what it is. See you at my next one. Well, I popped something out. Not sure what that is. It'd be great if it was something of great import, but I think it's just a tap for something. It's like two circles. Um, they're all set from each other. That almost looks like a button hook. Not really sure about that. I don't see any design or fancy. See it in the next one. Digging for another target. Uh, looks like. That was probably some piece of uh, jewelry or clothing. Maybe some kind of decorative sash buckle. There's a little tiny, couple of little tiny holes in it. Had a purpose. Door lock. I'm not sure. They look like pinholes to me or some type of fine sewing hole. See you at my next one. Pulled something else out of that hole where I found like the, the buckle like thing. Not really sure what that is. I think I just broke it. Some type of tack head nail or something. Not really that great. See you at my next one. Howdy, howdy, howdy. PA Treasure Hunters here again. Um, we're back out near the 1828 permission that I was just at with Bob. Um, I think I pulled a buffalo nickel and a tire iron. We're at the property adjacent to that. Um, we reached out to the homeowner, uh, got a new permission. See you at the first find. It's got a nice high tone right there, uh, 27, 28. I'm gonna give that a dig. Oh, that ground's hard. I'll see you after I have that out. Got my first find here. Uh, Something big, something metally. It's round. I can't quite make that out top to a pipe or something. 
See you at my next one. Well, on to target number two. I got the plug out, got some dirt out. I think I came across it. It looks like I got a, oops, double dog hook. That's actually still working. That's probably a nice brass one. See what my next find. Got another tone here by this old stump. Solid 21. Not uh, super deep. Other side of this stump's where I found that dog thing, dog leash hook. Try to pop this out so I don't get too much shadow on it. It's still in the hole. Let's see if we can't find that. Uh, 21. To just missed it here in the side. A little bit down in there. All right, I'll start pushing the button. See if I can't. Uh, I think I see some junk right here. That looks like a giant seven up bottle cap, so that's not very historic. But that was my target. Let's see what my next one. Got a shallow 22 right there. It's in the plug. Oh, winds are blowing. That's cold. Plugs back in the hole. See some old brick. Target's right in there. Gosh, it's cold out today. It's about. 30 degrees in PA, but with that wind blowing, makes it a lot colder. That's a rock. I don't see anything yet. It was shallow, not in the clump. It's going to be in this statue part. I finally see something. Oh, it looks like I got a little piece of something. My best guess is because of that weird taper shape to it. That might have been part of an old piece of jewelry. No fancy design on it. Kind of neat. Pretty thick there. Uh, jewelry might be a stretch, but see you at my next one. Got a squelchy tone. Uh, looks like I might have pulled. I don't know, part of a pan, part of a seat pan. Not really sure on that one. Chunk of flat iron. See you at my next one. I'm out near a, a huge pine tree. 
and uh, I don't know, about 10 feet out. I got a solid 21 down here in the hole. Already got the plug popped out. Straighten the camera up a little bit. Right in there. I don't see anything. Nope, oh, I do see something. Uh, oh, it got me something. Maybe a buckle. Be not too hard with it. Oh, it is. Something neat. Maybe a sash buckle. Let me get my brush out and see if I can't not destroy this. Let's say something used to slip through right there. That's kind of cool relic. It's got maybe I can't quite see in all the shade of this tree, but there might be a little bit of a pattern on that. You know, I see like dots or stars. See it in my next one. Oh, wind's still blowing. I hope it's not making the camera too funky. I think I got something here in the plug. It's in there, it's being bashful. I forget what the number was, it wasn't that great. Maybe a... Did I just throw it away? Picking up a shovel. It's a tough one. It says it's right down below me. I'll see you after I find it. Found it. I think it's a snap. Got a little, little tiny pattern on it right there. Maybe some words. I see a D. Maybe dent. Uh, I'll look at it underneath my magnifying glass, but it's definitely a snap. See you at the next one. I think I got something in the plug, something in the hole. I'm gonna go for the hole first. It there in the edge, I'm not sure if I see a blob of slaw. Got a piece of flashing, one of my favorites. They ring up awesome. That was flashing, kind of leads me to believe it. This is going to be flashing too. It'd be a nice surprise though if it turned out to be a coin. Right there. Come on out. Nope, oh, looks like I got another piece of the same flashing. Alright. See you at my next one. Got a beautiful Chris 27, 28 right there. Gonna give that a dig. See after I have it out. Still in the hole. Must have just missed it. Where's it hiding? Try right about there. Wouldn't it be nice to get a coin? Oh, I see something down there, and that is not a coin that I can tell. Yeah. 
I'll keep digging on that. That might be just a chunk of aluminum. See after I have it out. That did ring up beautiful. That's a uh, top to something. Uh, I'm not sure. Old oil can. Can't really tell. But it rang up like a solid, solid 27, 28. I thought I was going for a silver dime. See the next one. Pop something out. Oh, it looks like I may have finally got a coin. Yeah, it's a memorial. Might be nicked up a little bit. Yeah. I think it was ringing up a 24, so it could be a copper one. There's a Lincoln in there somewhere. See my next one. I got one in this hole. Uh, sorry about the shadow, but I got to be in this side because I'm uphill from it. Or it's uphill from me. Got something there. It's like a little shell casing. Can't read the caliber. Let's see the next one. Took a little spit in my magnifying glass at the end of it. I think it's a 35 Remington. Let's see it my next one. Okay, got a nice solid 19 here in a plug. Yeah, it looks like I got another rifle cartridge. Feels about the same as the other one, so I'm just gonna take a shot that that's another 35 Remington. See it in the next one. I think I got a one in the plug, one in the hole. I can see the one in the hole. Got a dime. That's what the one I thought was in the plug. Clad dime. Better than nothing. Better than a, better than a punch in the gut. I think I got one in this plug too. Maybe I got two dimes. I think my battery might have died on me during that shot. So I pulled one dime out of the hole and then I had another dime here in the plug. Both of them were clad. Yeah, there's Eisenhower or Roosevelt. Let's see up the next one. Got another nice high tone. 25, 26, 27 right there. That's worth a dig. Add to my coffee money it would be great. It's in the plug. Kind of hiding in there. Cut some of the plug off. Right in there. Thanks for another coin. Oh, there's another dime. I can see the coin print right there. Looks like another clad Roosevelt. Let's see the next one. It's got a higher tone. Here in the plug. Must be about halfway in there. Could be a penny. Could be something better. Ooh, 
Hmm. Thought it was in the plug. Oops, headphones fell off. Take a scoop and see if I can see it. Take a scoop and see if I can get it in my hand. Oh, I got it in my hand. There's a coin there. Looks like Lincoln. Looks like a memorial. See you at my next one. Got a surface find down there. I can see it with my own eyes. There's a shield penny. Not fared that well. See you at my next one. There's Bob over there. He's beeping away. I think he's on a target. I got a... I think it was like a 17 in the plug. Kind of hoping I'd pull like an Indian penny or something. I'll see you after I have it out. There's another... Guess what's in the clump? Still there. Kind of see a little something there. And I'm not thinking Indian head penny. I'm really leaning towards pool tab. See it in the next one. This is ringing up beautiful. Kind of looks like a tooth of something. Not sure. It's not a silver quarter. See it in the next one. Might have the best or coolest find of the day. This is almost in the same plug as where I found that like tooth. Got something round. Feels lead like, it's kind of heavy. Got some slits in there. Like it might have been hollowed out, but that's the best find of the day. Oh, lost it. Got it back. Not sure what that is, but kind of neat looking it's very heavy if you know what that is or could have been add it into the comments got something in the plug uh, kind of see a little bit of an iron look right there oh might be a piece of horse tack It's definitely a big old ring. Could be part of a bridle. I'll see it in my next one. You got something big down here. I'm going for it. Might be the most interesting find of the day. It's got a hook on top. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that out. I'm going to keep at that. See what that happens to be. See it when, after I have it out. Now that baby's probably been lost because that was down in the ground. You know. Three inches, that's been lost for some time, but I'll turn that into the homeowner. 
and see if they want to use that for their their dog. That's a pretty nice little dog thing. I will see you at my next one. Got a solid 13. Pinpoint's right there. Maybe, maybe two bars down. Oh, back to the where the ground can't be dug too well. That might be enough to get it. I think it's still in the hole. Poke around with a pinpointer and see if I can't find that. See after I have it out. I'll keep poking around the hole, but it looks like I hit part of an old mason jar. Uh, part I normally find. Just a lid. No uh, glass jar full of silver Morgan dollars down there. See you at my next one. Well, here's my wrap up. Uh, I think it's like um, two hunts. I uh, wanted a local permission and one at a property that bordered the 1828 meeting house. Um, for good, you know, it's gonna be a stretch. Uh, found an old flat button at the local property, out the one that had butted the um, 1828 one. I found what appears to be an old snap. I believe it says dent make and has a big D in the middle. Um, found this really cool sash buckle. Be my best guess out there. Found this that looks like, you know, if I flatten that out, it used to be the frame for something. I'm not really sure. Uh, here is something that was maybe for a door lock or something. Um, this double ended dog leash hook that still works. Old ring, I thought it might be horse stack, but it looks too irony to be that. This that looks to be some form of a dog tag. Uh, I think I see 1938 on there. Three, four, two, two, 1938, and I think See the county up there at the top that I live in. So that's kind of that's kind of a cool thing. Yeah, I think I was pretty sure that's 38. Uh, onto my clad, I pulled uh, three clad dimes, and it looks like I got six pennies, uh, three coppers, one zinc and like shield penny, and then onto my ugly. This rang up a 32. I thought I was on to a uh, silver quarter. A uh, bunch of under junk here. Your various um, can slaw, pool tabs, flashing, bits from a mason jar. This was something to something. I'm not really sure. I might hang on to that for a bit and see if somebody identifies it. Uh, two cartridges uh, from a 35 Remington. Other little metallic bits. Fun times. See you at my next one.